So I pin him down. Again, I don't care if his knees are to his chest or if his feet are on the ground, whatever it is, I get nice and low. When I drop for this, this pass, right? When I drop underneath, I don't want his legs down on my biceps and then I have to try to lift him, okay? I want to get my shoulders lower than his legs. Then I lock and I drive, okay? Don't think you want to try and get biceps to try to lift them up to try to grab it. You're never going to be able to make the separation. Okay? Lift it up. Get the pass. I threaten the choke. Start diving underneath. He defends. Put my weight on it. Bam. I start defending. Now, with this other hand, one of the Americana defense, a very common one, if this inside arm here, I don't know, I just waggled my ass. That was weird, right? But if this inside arm is free, he'll start reaching to try to lock his hands, okay, and pull his arm over his body. Okay? So as soon as he does that, I place his hand on the ground, he reaches over, I'm gonna windshield wiper my legs, put my knee right on his, under his nose, my arm's gonna weave over, hook, and I hold on to his other tricep as I sit back. Now my bottom knee here is gonna come up, I should be able to armbar. Okay? So I threaten the choke, to threaten the Americana, to break his arm. Do it one more time. Yeah. So, I tripped him, you should have seen it, it was perfect, right? Sweep the, swept the foot out, put him right on his back. Okay, got a hold of his pants, I threatened one way or another, not too much work. Just kind of drive under, hips down. Let him freak out a little bit, right? He's gonna kick his feet, he's gonna try to squeeze everything out, that's fine. I'm just gonna hold on, if he does that, even better. Now I'm already by one leg, right? I'll sit here for a little bit, give him a couple of seconds, I'll cook him, maybe hold him up. Right, this whole time he's having a little bit of a harder time breathing. My forearm's already on his neck. He hates me. He doesn't know why he came to class tonight. All right, I keep that pressure. I start looking underneath for the choke. He's fighting. All right, fine. Grip that arm. Start putting pressure on it. Threaten the Americana. He doesn't like that, so he grips. We shoot the wiper. I'm grabbing that arm. So that hand that was under his tricep here is going to hook onto his bicep. Okay, or back in, whichever it ends up being. Now step over that head, pulling towards me. Hook that arm, my knee pinches. Don't have to step over the body. If you want to, that's fine. We're right here, even if he's got his hands locked, I should be able to use those grips to pry his arms apart and finish. Questions? One, two, three.